Police in West Palm Beach are still investigating how a bicyclist got caught in the middle of an opening drawbridge and fell to her death. They're looking into the cyclist's conduct and whether she ignored warnings, but they're also investigating the operator to see if errors were made before opening the bridge. CBS 12's Danielle DeRoss joins us from the Royal Park Bridge with the latest. The Royal Park Bridge is a popular path for bicycles, boats, foot traffic, and cars connecting West Palm Beach and the island. Over the weekend, it became the scene of a risky rescue attempt and a deadly fall through the drawbridge. Police say an older female cyclist was walking her bike across the bridge as it started to open. So this part of the bridge is going up, gates are coming down. She was just 10 feet away from making it to safety, but she ended up close to here. This part of the bridge, when it's in an upright position, opens and creates a wide gap. There was a man on a skateboard that was on the fixed portion of the bridge on the west side who tried desperately to help this woman as she was trying to hold on to the bridge as it went up. Uh, despite those efforts, the woman was not able to hold on and she fell uh, to the concrete landing below to her death. Police say the investigation now focuses on who the cyclist is and how this happened. There are several warning signs, like a loud alarm and flashing lights, to make traffic stop before the drawbridge opens. The bridge tender is also supposed to walk this catwalk and visually confirm that all cars and people are clear before raising the bridge. Police are checking to make sure that that tender followed protocols. Detectives have spoken to the bridge tender. She was obviously uh, very upset at what happened. Michael Pike is a personal injury attorney in West Palm Beach. If there was not a warning, then there possibly could be some liability. But if the tape plays back and there was a warning and this person attempted to get across the bridge, which we don't know yet, that's a different story. He says while the investigation continues, people crossing the bridge should be reminded to stay alert and stop once they hear that drawbridge bell. That was our Danielle DeRoss reporting. Of course, we'll keep you posted on that story. We'll